thighs as you slowly float away. Again, think of reaching and then lowering down. And again, inhale as you lift, exhale as you lower. So think of the toes reaching away from your fingertips and down. And just got two more here. Inhale and exhale. And last one, inhale and exhale flex the foot and lift again keep it going now so move it a little bit quicker once you've got your rhythm avoid bringing the foot all the way down to the floor you're just staying a fraction off each time reaching out through the heel you've just got two more to go and exhale and last one inhale here and exhale take a rest Bring yourself carefully up, so push into the floor to come up. You're going to swivel the legs around the other way. So make sure that you get your position and your alignment correct. The spine is in line with the back edge of your mat. Your heels are in line with your tailbone. Your knees are bent. Tommy's drawing in, moving into the clam exercise where you just open the top knee and then just gently squeeze. So you're gonna hit, it's gonna hit here in the buttock. Slowly just drawing in as you breathe in and breathe out and again. So inhaling and exhaling. Excellent, well done. You're gonna straighten now that top leg and make sure that the ankle is in line with the knee, knee in line with the hip. You can move that lower leg a little bit forward for balance. You're just gonna float that leg away, see if you can reach that wall and then exhale as you lower down. And again, so it's about lengthening rather than lifting. And again, reaching away and lower. And let's just go for two more, reaching away and lower and last one in through the nose out through the mouth engaging the abdominals flexing now pressing out through the heel as you lift and come down a little bit quicker if we can that's it keep going you've just got two more and last one and then from here you at hip height just gently point the toes just go into your circles working from the crease of your bottom so it's very difficult here to keep the stability of the pelvis so keep as stable as you can you can imagine that there is a stake through that top hip 